What's up guys, it's Glitch Gaming here and in today's video I have the best unlimited XP glitches and methods. So this video has been requested by a few people on my last video and that's why I'm making it. And I just want to say that I have been busy over the past week with work and things like that. So that's why it hasn't been uploaded earlier. But let's get straight into this video. So to start off with this video, I'm going to be showing you the glitch that I have first and this is the best glitch for XP out there at the moment. But what you want to do is go into any workshop with all of your copper inside it and you want to take out as much copper as you can unless you have a lot like me. You want to take out about maximum of 20,000 because it can crash your game if you duplicate too much. But once you've took it out of your workshop, it should be in your inventory and you just want to drop it on the floor. And because I've done this glitch before, it is in two separate piles, but that doesn't matter, you can still do it. And what you want to do is press square X and circle once you're in workshop mode and you're hovering over the copper stack. And what should happen is this. Yes, you should hear the scrap noise once you scrap an item and also a little menu will pop up really fast just before the star menu which will say scrap and it will go quickly off without you saying anything and once the star menu pops up you want to press star and what this will do is basically duplicate it into your inventory so you've starred 20,000 copper and you've scrapped 20,000 copper if you know what I mean and now if you look in my inventory I do have more copper than I had when I started so also if you want to do this with any other item you can do you can duplicate any other item that can go into your workshop but once you've done that and you've duplicated your copper to the amount you want you want to go into workshop mode decorations statues and you want to use the statue of a man with a baseball bat and then you want to move back while building these statues at the same time and what this will do is give you a lot of XP and you can just scrap the statues after that if you want to make up some room and this is the best glitch out there for XP so now one of the methods I have three methods to show you and the first one is using signs to place over the top of each other and you can also use the resource duplication glitch that I literally just showed you in the last glitch to do this to get all of your steel that you need for this glitch and you want to go on to workshop mode and go over to any wall and pick a sign that you want I use the non-smoking sign probably the easiest one to use and you just want to go up to the wall and place down one as you can see and you don't have to move, you can just keep placing down on top of each sign and you will get 4 XP for doing this each time. So if you do this rapidly you're getting 40 XP every second which is quite decent for a XP method and as I said you can get the steel for this XP method from the glitch that I showed you earlier but doing it with steel instead of copper and also you can scrap the sign to get two steel back if you would like. Now on to the next method you want to come over to Albany Farm and for this XP method you will need a lot of wood so you can also use the glitch at the start of this video to help you with this method but once you're over here you should see the main building and the entrance at the front and there should be a door there that you can just scrap and you want to go into the workshop mode and go over to doors and you want to scroll across until you see the doors that look like they're snapped in half and you want to place it down and this is just like the last glitch you can place lots and lots of doors on top of each other so you'll get 4 XP each time and you can just rapidly press X to get a lot of XP, nearly 40 XP every second and of course you will need some wood and steel for this and 
it does look pretty funny when you try and open the door because you need to open like a million doors but you can also scrap this door as well until all of the doors are fully scrapped so now onto the last method for this video and what you want to do is come over to a place on the map with a large area that is flat and I suggest coming over to Sanctuary Hills and just use one of these empty pad things and you want to go on a workshop to shack floor and what you will do is line it up with the writing as you can see I put a blue line on the screen and if you do that and if you place it in correctly then it will automatically place a sort of like a d-pad shape full of wood shack floors and if you rapidly press x it will just place them automatically and you can also get a lot of xp while doing this but you will need to get a lot of wood and steel so i hope you enjoyed this video i did put a lot of effort into it and please comment down below what glitch you would like to see next and if you did like the video then leave a like subscribe until next time see you